Well, hello there again. It's your lovely host here. It is Team Rai. Now, have you, anyone seen the very first video of the day? If not, smash that bell. And of course, you will get a notification from YouTube. And don't worry, I'll discuss my social media accounts after this part of the video is over. Now, switching your sit back, relax, be your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and the subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Now, in this video, it'll be strictly a link. You know why? There's an article plus there's a video down below. Let's get into this show and load. First of all is, I am not looking forward to this match. Bobby Lashley versus Bray Wyatt. Who gives a flying crap about it? The original game plan is supposed to happen. Brock Lesnar versus Bray Wyatt. But I guess Brock Lesnar want nothing to do with um, Bray Wyatt. I never knew that Brock Lesnar has pulled backstage. He's just a performer. That's all he is. You know, that is BS. But, you know, this is definitely not going to be a great match. Okay? In my opinion. But maybe it will surprise people. But the build-up, it just blah. You know, they have... I don't know when they start... Decided to switch gears. Because it's supposed to be Lesnar. What happened at um, the last pay-per-view. How it ended. There was a crappy ending... Who came up with this stupid idea with the ending? And I guarantee we will see another crappy finish at Mania for night one or night two. I guarantee it. One of those matches. Because Dovey is dumb. Sometimes they can't think of a, a great finish. Oh, wow. You know what? We can't think of a good finish. Let's just have a... Let's, let's have Lesnar or Bible actually do like a low blow and that'd be a crappy finish. That sounds good to me. You know what I'm saying? That's how they... Make these stupid ideas, you know? And that's not the first time it did that. It will probably will do that in the future. Not just for WWE, other wrestling companies. Because they can't think of new ideas. New finishers. <sighs> I guarantee I could do a better job. And you could do it too, probably. Okay. On the latest edition of his Jim Cornette Experience Podcast. Legacy. I mean, legend, manager, slash broker. Jim Cornette shares his stars. On the Bray Wyatt and Bobby Lashley WrestleMania 39 feud. It's not really a feud because they just started it, what, not that long ago. So it's not really a feud feud. It's like they just, I don't know, just the way they do it, it's kind of stupid, okay? Re review Wyatt Music Man Dead video for Lesnar. I mean, sorry. Um... Bobby, Bobby, on this week's episode of Monday Night Raw, and you can check it out. I don't think anybody gives a fuck, flying crap about it. Sorry, I said the F word. Sorry. So, I don't think anybody is pleased about this storyline. It's not really a storyline. They just put these two guys into the square circle, and then they started to um, start a feud. You know, how can you have a feud? That quickly, you know, you gotta have like months and months of, of building up. You know, I guess they don't only do it for certain wrestlers, not this one. And another thing is, I thought when the Bray Wyatt came back to the WWE, he's gonna have high hopes, but this whole thing is a huge letdown. It is huge letdown at the Rumble, and then was that is that the Neon match or whatever that match. That match was dog crap. And, you know, and they can't let Bray Wyatt go because people say, he's, I don't know. I don't know why he came back in the first place, you know. Maybe because he wants so demanding of his character and he wants to control it. No one else. So, I don't know. I thought by now we'll get the Syrian. I'm sorry, I messed up again. For a crown out. I thought we will get the white six. But maybe. Things change over weeks and weeks and weeks. You know. Remember when he first came back to the WWE. That was insane on the Extreme Rules. Wow. I thought we were going to see see the, the white six. But nope. That would be a great stable. So I don't know what's going on. You know. I have no idea. I don't know if he has issues with. Triple H backstage. Or he. Or maybe he decided to keep changing it all the time and then the Triple H is getting fed up with him. I don't know what's the real deal with him, you know? I don't know how many times they're going to have patience with Bray Wyatt. 
you know some people are very excited to see him back i was very excited the first night great return they're coming in then after that and just keep going rock bottom so i don't know if he gives it up with this character and why does he keep having this long boring feud with la knight no one does not give a flying crap about that feud who cares i don't care about it maybe it's just me but i don't care for it i'm glad he moved on with a different feud now will la knight eventually will continue his feud with bray wyatt in the future maybe maybe not but that's not a very good feud to return to the company the way could do way better but that's the way for you now i'm gonna switch gears and what do you think about the article and what's your thoughts on the video down below now follow me on instagram twitch twitter tech call my social media accounts down below if you want to be part of the show that's fine again if not then don't worry about it and i'll see you guys tomorrow sometime be careful be safe enjoy the rest of your sunday peace out and take care